mastering adulthood go beyond adulting to become an emotional grown-up by Laura E. Gilding Psy-D P-S-Y-D so you get four parts chapters stated under each part um, an introduction tells you what you can expect in each part so you get a pause gray horizontal bar across a page which is an acti activity something to do a journal prompt or prompts for you so again you get inform information with personal story tie-ins so examples so I kind of like this because it I liked it in a way because you get information with its information with the tie not a story with information tying into it so I kind I like that information with a story tie-in not the other way around so it's not formal slash academic writing and not fully academic information so a quote unquote average reader understanding could like myself could understand it and you're not thrown with like weird references that only full-fledged academics would <laughs> would understand um, and what I liked about the personal stories was it's quick to the point and integrated into the point that was being made and so it wasn't fully focused on the story so you, you get QR codes so if you have an app that reads them you can use it in some of the let's practice sections like the check-in points so you kind of get a virtual aspect to the book so so you get stuff like um, practicing acceptance of limitations two types of commitment working with your here and now experience um, self-compassion choosing who's to come whose discomfort, um, getting clear about your needs, and so forth and other topics. So you get um, pause and the less, let's practice activities slash to-dos. So you do get that interaction uh, um, to get that information out of the book. So to start printing pen to paper kind of aspect to the book so um, reference self-help it's reference self-help kind of book so you do have this if you need that kind of book in your life at the moment so yeah mastering adulthood by Laura E. Fielding happy readings